Elon Musk is the richest man in the world, making nearly a thousand dollars every second. But how did his various companies make him so rich and what do they even do? SpaceX was founded by Elon Musk back in 2002 as a pioneer in private space exploration and transportation. Ever since he was young, Elon dreamed of colonizing planets like Mars in order to expand human civilization. And after spending hundreds of millions to get it off the ground, he managed to make it a sustainable business worth billions. Thanks to being able to launch satellites, cargo, and more, SpaceX has been able to obtain high-paying government contracts while also creating their very own global Wi-Fi network called Starlink, which alone has generated over $1.4 billion in revenue. Despite this success, it hasn't come without its issues because with multiple failures, explosions, and delays, there has been occasional concern with the company, but this is no different from Elon's most iconic company, Tesla. Founded back in 2003, Tesla was one of the first electric car manufacturers in the market Market, which was a death sentence back then. The first ever car that Tesla released was in 2008 called the Roadster, being fully based off of a Lotus Elise chassis. And despite this huge risk, it ended up saving the company because if this model had failed, Elon and Tesla would have gone bankrupt. Four years later, Tesla released the Model S, which took the world by storm, proving electric cars could outperform petrol. But this wasn't without its controversy. Due to large amounts of lobbying, hit pieces were often put out against Tesla, and any time there was an incident with their famous self-driving capabilities, Tesla was put on blast. But this didn't stop Elon. And after growing its lineup to the Model X, Model 3, Model Y, and now Cybertruck, it is currently valued at over $770 billion. But guess what? Things get even crazier because now Tesla has embarked on its new ambitious journey, creating AI robots in order to help the world. But in the worst case that they do try and take over, Elon Musk's other company might have a solution. A few years ago, you may have seen Elon Musk with his not a flamethrower, and this was created by his boring company, which is actually a joke in itself. This company is responsible for building and developing subterranean infrastructure stemming from Elon's idea to revolutionize transportation through tunnel networks under urban cities. Founded in 2016, Elon has started building tunnels underneath the busy dystopia of Los Angeles in order to test his theory. And after completing his first tunnel, it was proven that this idea is indeed a massive success. But it still has a long way to go, just like his next venture. Neuralink is an idea straight from science fiction, where Elon has dreamed of how people can control the world using purely their mind and artificial intelligence. Founded in 2016, Neuralink's primary goal was to help those with impairment or disabilities to help people regain lost abilities like nerve damage or curing speech loss. But this has not been without its controversy, as ethical concerns have been raised about the ability to manipulate cognitive functions and how socially there are no regulations surrounding this idea. Despite this, Neuralink has been successfully implanted into its first human trial, with initial success building on Musk's idea that this technology will be essential for humans to expand. Neuralink is valued at $5 billion, but I think it's time to talk about Elon's most controversial company yet. In 2022, Elon Musk took the world by storm, purchasing the corrupted Twitter and transforming it into X, one of the first social media platforms to expose algorithmic manipulation and promoting true freedom of thoughts and expression. Despite his other companies being so profitable, X has lost over $30 billion in its value since the time of purchase, largely due to all of the controversies surrounding it. Elon believes in true freedom, something that the ultra wealthy and elite hate since all they want to do is control the population, which has again resulted in hundreds of online hit pieces against the platform doing everything in their power to stop his success. But even though this has been happening, X has been strongly supported by Elon's cult following and has seen a massive increase in users on the platform, which is slowly helping the business regain its value. But speaking of controversial businesses, ChatGPT has disrupted the world as we know it, which is why in 2023, Elon has founded XAI. This new company focuses on using artificial intelligence in a safe, transparent, and beneficial manner for humanity, using cutting edge research, innovative applications, and ethical considerations for its development. Elon hopes to be a rival to ChatGPT, and since this company is so new and private, 
little is actually known about how successful it currently is. But what is known is that if Elon Musk can successfully take over the AI space, he will be able to integrate this into all of his other businesses, which would definitely make him the world's first trillionaire. But don't worry, because Elon is actually extremely charitable. Founded in 2001, the Musk Foundation is a nonprofit organization dedicated to philanthropy. This foundation is focused on creating renewable energy for developing nations, pediatric research, and providing education and support to those in need. And this is one of the places Elon focuses focuses most on since he believes in helping all of humanity and not just those who make him the most money. But speaking of money, how did he even make his first large amount? Founded in 1995, Elon created a company called Zip2 in the days of the early internet. Zip2 provided a way for newspapers to develop an online presence, offering business directories and maps to their readers. Costing only $28,000 to start up, Musk grew this company over the next four years, where in 1999, it was sold for a whopping $307 million dollars, which he used on his next company, X.com, aka PayPal. Founded in 1998, PayPal set out to transform the world of online payments by allowing fast, simple, secure online transactions, letting people and businesses send and receive money electronically. Elon demanded the platform be user-friendly and safe for anyone to make an account, and as the internet grew, so did PayPal and its profits. In the coming years, the internal board of the company began to worry about Elon's control, and he was betrayed and ousted from his role. But in doing so, he was able to sell his portion of the business for a whopping $1.5 billion, which was then used to start Tesla and also SpaceX. But how about his green energy project? Well, in 2006, Elon Musk bought a majority shareholder stake in SolarCity, which was responsible for solar panel installations and other clean renewable energy technologies in a cost-effective way. Over the next decade, the company grew, and in 2016, it was fully purchased by Musk and Tesla Tesla for $2.6 billion, which is why you now see products like Tesla's solar roof, farms, batteries, and much more. But wait, there's one more hidden company you definitely didn't know about that Elon actually owned. That's right, in 2015, Elon Musk, along with some of the other most influential figures in the tech world, founded OpenAI, the creator of ChatGPT. Elon invested a total of $1 billion into the company to start it off. Initially, OpenAI aimed to conduct cutting-edge research in the field of AI and develop technologies that align with its principles of broadly distributed benefits, long-term safety, technical leadership, and cooperative orientation. OpenAI envisioned a future where artificial intelligence benefited all of humanity, while avoiding the uses of AI that could harm people or give certain people too much power. But sadly, in 2018, Elon left OpenAI citing a conflict of interest with his work at Tesla, just before the release of ChatGPT. But now, what crazy things do you think Elon Musk will do next? Well, make sure to subscribe because once there is something new, we will be sure to simply explain everything.